Okay, it's the game of the week in the Big 12. Unfortunately, it's going to be tough to watch it. That's Iowa State at Texas. I'm Pete Mundo, HeartlandCollegeSports.com, your independent Big 12 digital media outlet. Well, the loser of this game cannot make the Big 12 championship game. The winner is still in the mix. It's a huge game, and I'm going to figure out a way to watch it. I don't know how yet, but I'm going to figure out a way to watch it. If you have any way to watch it, please do drop it in the comments because it's on Longhorn Network. I don't get Longhorn Network. 99% of America doesn't get Longhorn Network, so we have to help each other out here. So this game to me, um, I love what Iowa State's defense is doing. And the ingenuity of the Texas offense has not grown all that great in the last few weeks. Sam Ellinger has gotten a lot better. I'll give him that. But the ingenuity of what they're doing hasn't changed. It's still kind of a boring offense. It's just everybody's gotten better at what they're doing. The offensive line has improved. Ellinger's improved. Uh, little Jordan Humphrey and Colin Johnson continue to grow confidence and get better and better. So everyone's getting better, but the offense is not any more interesting. And this Iowa State defense is just so darn good. It's the best in the Big 12 by a long shot. Uh, look at what this team is doing week after week against teams like West Virginia and Baylor. And these are good offenses. And Iowa State is holding them in check. And then on the other side of the ball, Texas's defense has struggled mightily as of late. And Brock Purdy's walking into this thing with a ton of confidence. I know it's going to be a difficult road environment for a true freshman. I totally understand that. But I just – I love what Matt Campbell has going on for this team right now. I have total confidence in Matt Campbell uh, with the number one pass defense efficiency in the Big 12. And when you think about rushing defense, the top rushing defense in the Big 12, Iowa State has it going on that side of the ball, and that has to be a factor going into this game. It should be. It absolutely should be a factor going into this game, even though Iowa State is on the road. And also, uh, when you think of this team and, you know, turnover margin, it's basically a wash. They're both in the same boat on the plus side of that. So I like Iowa State to go down to Austin, Texas, and pick up a win by a field goal. Give me the Cyclones by a final of 30-27 to 27 over the Texas Longhorns in Austin. There you have it, our two-minute preview. Subscribe. We appreciate that, and we'll talk to you soon at heartlandcollegesports.com.